All right, welcome everyone. We're Semblance of Sanity. I'm Caleb. I'm Jacob. And we're here for One Out, episode, episode three. three. All right. Will Kojima hit the ball. Yes, yes, we shall see. Uh, Toa mm -hmm. has perfectly analyzed and deduced yep. uh, Kojima's situation with his hand. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, this bet is all in. Whether or not Kojima will even have a career after this is completely up in the air. Mm -hmm. Along with the ball that yep. is rocketing seemingly towards his face. Indeed. Yeah. But we'll see. And and also the the uh, how the how the rest of the show is gonna go, because mm -hmm. whoever wins here, that changes things. That changes things. And yeah. this could be just an example of something that puts Toa on the map. Yeah. As far as Major yep. League Baseball goes. Oh yeah, he just ruined the career of this guy, and then some other team is like, "Hey, let's let's get you." You know? Sure. Yeah. Sure. Yep. Yeah, it could literally just be the the trainer Kinosaki, mm -hmm. where he's like, "Um, well, shit." Kojima's crazy, but right. you, you're crazier. So I mm -hmm. I I want to see what's going on with you. Exactly. And uh, yeah, let's let's follow Toa's uh, uh way. He's going to. <laughs> He's going to continue whatever yeah, his yeah. story he's is. He's going to keep going. Whatever his this story is, is his story. Keep going. Yeah, yeah. And it's just whether or not Kojima will be around mm -hmm. in the show. Probably. Yeah. So, y'all, without further ado, let's get into this. Yeah, awesome. Uh huh. Oh shit. Mm. Yeah, the closing of his eyes. If this is over, it's not because he's going to miss it. Mm. いんたしたってお前らずっと理科運ぞの一員じゃないかこんなところで俺はいやはいはいはいはいはいはいはいはいはいはいはいはいはいはいはいはいはいはいはいはいはいはいはいはいはいはいはいはいはいはいはいはい
契約金と言われるものは出ない。わ、okay. かるよね。今年の年俸だが、こういうのは実績に応じて支払うもの。Oh. 唯一掛け野球での勝敗が四百九十九勝一。Wow. <笑>こういうのは実績とは言えんがね。いらねえよ。ん年俸やら契約金やらそんな甘えた金はいらねえよ。I'm here because of a bet and nothing else. ワンナウト、五百万。Wait. Oh, interesting. Oh, a bounty hunter picture. Yeah, that's actually、oh, shit. Oh, what? <laughs> what? Holy shit. What? And it keeps、Holy、it gambling、shit. for him, which is probably. Okay. He could force、oh、him to、God. stay in the game longer, though, to try and get money off of them.、Though. Well, well, no, the way they would have to do it is he would have to have the other players intentionally play badly、mm. with their fielding. Oh, sure. Yeah. <laughs> Me. Oh. Oh, okay. That's really good. つまりだ。一試合二点七しか点を取られない選手。タイトルを狙えるほどの優秀なピッチャーだということだ。ではそのピッチャーにお前が無茶苦茶だと言ったさっきのワンナウツ契約に当てはめて。あは。球団が払う金はいくらだ。あは。あ？ププラスマイナスゼロ。貧乏人ほど金額のデカさに惑わされる。小島君のわがままでとんでもない粗大ゴミを引き受けることになる。Yeah, the tender one is a bit rough for Toa. And it's because the team can be used against him. Is it worth it? You know? Yeah, fifty thousand dollars for an out isn't like crazy. Yeah, fifty thousand dollars. 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 <laughs> Never warmed up a day in my life. Now he's also kind of insulting them as well. Yeah. Yeah, that's going to be an interesting relationship him with the, with the catcher. Yeah. Sometimes captains are s Oh, yeah, good And of course, they're watching the game here.、Mm -hmm. Oh, already. Oh, already. Oh shit. Oh my god! <laughs> Where did all the eight points come from then? That was at the beginning. They were down by eight points. Oh my god. So he gave them seven shutouts and they couldn't score another、What? single run. ニカオンズ対フィンガーズのオープン戦が行われようとしていますオープン戦とはいえ初の先発ですからさぞかしい緊張しているんでしょうね小島さんどうでしょうあ,あ寝ていますはぁはぁいい加減にせいはぁはぁひどいすコーチわーおい Technically, a no hitter doesn't count unless you did it from the whole game. The whole game, yeah, yeah. He'd be showing info off based on his pitch. Yeah, yeah. Uh huh. And it's also a mind game with the other people. Of like, yeah, I'm this big hot shot, right? And it's also a mind game with the other people. Of like, yeah, I'm this big hot shot, right? Mm hmm. Yep, yep, yep. And there's the arrogance. Right. All right, catcher signals. Nice, clean.、Yep. And clean. Good、right. shit. And this is where Kojima is needed. 
先輩僕のことはいいですからなんてのんきな人たちなんだ。Yeah. こいつがどんなに恐ろしいピッチャーか。Same form every time. 現在6回表終わって0対0。Oh、なんと両チームノーヒット。何でね力で押しまくる川中とは対照的に。特地は独特ののらりくらりとしたピッチングでリンガーズ打線を完全に封じています。Okay. Oh, hell yeah. They're gonna get to third base. Oh, shit, that guy was fast. All right. From first to home. He got a good lead off of.、Uh... Shit. Oh, shit. He needs to see what happens. Like what it takes. ここへ来てフィンガーズの選手たちがようやく気づく自分たちは今とんでもない男を相手にしているということにだが気づくのがあまりにも遅かったいや小島の予言と川中の予感は現実になろうとしていた<笑><笑>ストライク、yep. バタードーあら、ノーヘア、あ、パーフェクトゲーム、やー、やー、パーフェクトゲーム。なんと、一人も塁に出すことなく、ダサ27人、すべてを打ち取りました !And there was like one, one ground out.How many、yeah. of them were strike outs though?I <laughs> like what you're doing, but why are you pissed?Like, like, yes, you're wrong, but. Well, you've got a gold it, mine it's, now. It's, it's still way more money than they have, probably. Oh, sure. Even though they fill the stadium and stuff.、Mm -hmm. Yeah. Talk to me. Actually, where it needs to be. They just can't hit it. <laughs> yep. Oh, that's the one that just broke. はい。Then they can have the dynamic of him being on the team、yep. and both of them being able to benefit and all that stuff.、Uh -huh. but, but they can't just have Toa, like, not, like, you know, like, they can't have him just give up a hit and that's what makes it right. happen, right? That like, because that makes sense. That would, that would reduce some of the, the, the rule of cool aspect and, and how, just how terrifying he is. But if Kojima swallows his pride and plays、yep. dirty in the same、uh -huh. way with the rules that have been given to him. Yep. That are not normal baseball rules. There are slight variations. Yes, you know. The, the thing that might be slightly off here is that,、um, in the typical sense of what constitutes a strike,、mm -hmm. is I don't think you can,、um, I don't think you can stick your foot out and hit the ball as it's coming towards the strike zone. Mm -hmm. Like, that's an intentional dead balling thing there. Right. But it would be basically up to the umpire to judge whether or not it was、right. basically an intentional dead ball versus whether or not the person、yeah. like, went out there. But it's not actually about. Now, this might be a thing with the Japanese rules,、mm -hmm. but it's not actually about whether it be a strike because a strike is not constituted a strike until it clears home plate. Like, it doesn't matter where it's approaching,、mm -hmm. it actually matters with where it. Like, yeah, it needs、crosses. to actually cross over home plate.、Yeah. But in this case, they don't, they're not playing with an umpire because, of course, right, that would、right. that'd be a conflict of interest,、wall. right?、Yeah. The umpire is the wall.、Uh -huh. And it didn't hit the wall.、Mm -hmm. There you go. I love it. Like, it's、like, perfect. It's, it's perfectly anime and yet, like, not like 
too extreme on the level of like well, some it was foreshadowed. Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah, it was right, established as yep. a rule. Mm -hmm. So as long as this anime keeps giving us the rules by which we can, you know, expect mm -hmm. um, uh, Toa to play within, and then sets up ways in which he subverts the rulings of that in order to win at any cost. Yeah, let's keep this going because mm -hmm. a lot of the things that make I would say a story on this level rather interesting is not the number of you know the amount of money he's gonna make right it's that's the, fun to hear it's but... the idea that all these players for instance are going to be involved in these games and they're gonna react to this oh yeah some of them might be okay with this mm -hmm. some of them might never find out that there's this one outs contract that's involved there sure some of them might get told from the coach to start playing shitty at fielding so that he can get some of his money back yep like, and th this could end up turning into something where we end up having the team not really, like, feeling like they're they're on Toa's side at times. Uh-huh. Who knows? We might end up even get something where because the owner has the whole financial issues because of the games, mm -hmm. then Toa says, okay, you could try and sabotage me by having, you know, our team give up points and stuff. Sure. Or start betting on me. Yep. Sure. That's how you can recoup your money, that's, right? That's and then, serious stuff, and, yeah. And that could be that could be a way to solve the money problem, mm -hmm. but then that adds additional stakes because then it goes back into like it could go into the okay, but if you sure. if you make me lose even more money, I will take my pound of flesh, you know. Yep. Like that it could also happen. could end up being a thing where um they're like, Well, we can just use Toa and because he wants the money, he'll always want to play, right? Mm -hmm. But what if they start turning the team against him and Toa's just like I'm not feeling it anymore. I'm just going to not play. That's true. Then they're like, well, fuck, we need to win this game. Right, right, we yeah. take the championship. He starts negotiating. I don't like, think so. Yeah. You want me to play? Every mm -hmm. out I make now is 10 million. Right. Yeah. Uh, okay. Well, this is the playoffs after all. You know, it wouldn't make sense to keep the same kind of pay, right? Yeah, yeah. I, I can see all kinds of mind games going on here mm -hmm. that stretch the bounds of what is considered to be like a baseball uh -huh. game oh, stakes. Yeah. You know, yep. it's not yep. about who scores the most points right. or who wins even. It's just about who's playing what position and at what time and then what players are the ones that are coming up to bat, you know, mm -hmm. or or are or are playing, you know, like yeah, there's Watch. so many crazy things that could happen here. There ends up being some money ball stuff where Kojima ends up getting traded, sold to another team okay. right before they're about to play them so that then he can hopefully get some points off of off of Toa to then get money for the coach. Wait. <laughs> like I don't that's not going to happen. What? There's no way that's going to happen. But He wouldn't be on his team. He'd have no obligation to be a part of the contract. No, no, no. Then. No, no, I know, but like if if the owner is like, "Okay, I need to get money back. I sell our best player to the team that we're about to face uh -huh. because I think he can get some runs off of Toa and then I'll have Toa pay me because then he gave up runs to the person that I figure would be able to get the Kojima? runs. Yeah, I know. That's no. crazy. It's never going to happen. But <laughs> I mean, I could see stuff on that level happening, but mm -hmm. not 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 Kojima. that exactly. Not yeah, with Kojima, it's no. but but because we're in a situation where now mm -hmm. he has thrown a perfect game, even though it was. You know, preseason. It was preseason. It was preseason. So people granted. weren't trying as hard. One of the things that's also yep. very common in preseason games is to allow like second, third string players hmm. to get playtime in because sure. it doesn't really matter that much. Mm -hmm. So yep. oftentimes, like maybe it's just a thing where certain players just, you know, they don't need necessarily the practice as much. And they put the rookies and stuff like that right in, in here and and for at the very least um this this uh this new uh rookie pitcher um maybe he's an example of one where he's like oh no 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 i i'm another person that was supposed to come in here and shake things up in the league and look at this toa guy he's already stealing my spotlight as right the, the yep. new rookie pitcher mm -hmm. uh, that's my brand man i was gonna i was gonna take the league with this but no nope. sure yep. i guess now i have a rival mm -hmm. lovely awesome and that's that's a way that they can keep the the conflict for Toa even more interesting because sure. since he's not necessarily going to be running into the same batter very often, you oh, know, rarely. like like in a, in a game, rarely. sure, but like you're only going to be playing a particular team so many times in a season, and you know all that stuff. Yeah, depending on how the Japanese season works, 
it might be like the US one where they do series with the same team and you play mm-hmm. them like three or five times. So what might actually happen is that Toa and their team will play against a team, you know, three times in four days, you know? And then it's sure. the thing of where they're already coming back to the game with these like angry expressions at Toa mm-hmm. or just defeated looks of like, right. shit. Or <laughs> we're just losing to someone throwing 75 mile an hour fastballs. Right, right. <laughs> What? what is this? And then his slow ball comes in at 55 down the middle, and we're just watching it go in? Yes, you are. Mm-hmm. Look at the games. They right. have, like, recordings, and they're yep, like, yep. look at this shit. And they're like, right. sure, it doesn't look like that. It doesn't feel like that. Like, you don't know what it's like when you're up there, man. Mm-hmm. Yep. Start. Stop giving out coffee to the people that don't get on base. You know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you, you basically be like, hey, coffee hey, is for closers. Coffee is for closers, yeah, exactly. Yeah. And y'all ain't some closers right now. Right. I, I would very much like to see also some of the more technical aspects of baseball rules that are um, ones that actually go in favor of batters and stuff like that. Because oh, there yeah. are a lot that I would say primarily focus on um, the fielding and the defense side of things. Mm-hmm. But they could get really dirty a la some of the older um, dirty baseball batters over the uh, over the decades that would do things to try and get in the pitcher's heads. And if you ended up basically having someone like Toa dominating in the league side of things, mm-hmm. maybe they're like, okay, let's fight fire with fire. And they start pulling out some weird stops from the batters kind of things to disrupt sure. Toa. And if, yeah, I could even see it being something yeah. where like, depend like, cause, cause Toa is going to change the game, right? That's, mm. that's kind of the point of it. Right. And, and he's already starting to change the game and yep. how do, how will these people respond to it? Yep. I could theoretically see something even happening where like one of the teams is like, hey, mm-hmm. you, you're not our best batter. OK, we want you to actually tr- like get pissed after he strikes you out and try and break his arm or something. Yeah, You'll get thrown mound, out of the game. The mound, yeah. yeah, yeah, exactly. Right. And, you know, oh, and yeah, we'll take care of you. You'll get thrown out of the game, whatever. You'll have some slap on the wrist. But, you know, well, it depends, actually. <laughs> Sometimes people can get suspended from baseball depending on the severity. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah, like your career is done. So Damn. you you'd have to convince the player mm-hmm. to like right. Uh, and then yeah. that could get into some really fun stuff where then Toa's like, "Oh, this feels just like home." You know, like like, "Oh yeah, because I can imagine in Toa's situation if he had people that were betting like really big amounts of money, yeah. things would get all kinds of messy." For sure. You know. Yeah, the one weakness I think that Toa has is one that they set up in uh, in this kind of preliminary kind of mm-hmm. beginning stage of the show here is bunting because that's something that he specifically is not a part of the one outs games that you don't bunt right now bunting typically I would say is not good of a strategy to get on base a lot of the time because most catchers are skilled enough mm-hmm. that they don't need the pitcher to come in and basically right. get the person out but and that could be a cool dynamic between Toa and the catcher where it's like, yes. okay, I got you, boo. You know? Yeah, like, oh, this guy's getting prepped to bunt. Okay. Mm-hmm. Pitchers can also do a thing where they'll intentionally, immediately after the throw, they'll pick a side, either the third base or the first base line. They can come in there and be prepped for the bunt going too hard. Sure. Um, well, and also, yeah. if we'll Toa's see. throwing slower balls, it's not going to go as far with the bunt. Well, right. No, no, so, like, a good bunter can put it as far as they want or what have you. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. Bunting doesn't rely on the speed of the ball. Gotcha. Yeah, yeah. A huh. good, a good bunter. Will... I did not know that. I, yeah, th- yeah. I figured it would because it's angle. Totally, but like, if the if the ball is coming in like thirty miles an hour slower than like you know they would normally expect, right? Yeah, but the amount of control you have because when you bunt, you run through the base. Oh, okay. And the bat, meaning that you end up getting to give it force and deaden it. And or deaden it, whichever way you want. Gotcha. So a good a good bunter like like um, Ichiro for the Mariners, for instance. Yeah, by the time he made contact with the ball, he was already like 15. Like he, by the time the ball had hit the ground anywhere, he was already about 15 to like 20 feet away from home plate. Like, like, like that's how much control you right. have when you when you bunt properly. Yeah, and Ichiro's fast. Well, yes, he was an exceptional bunter, but mm-hmm. I'm just saying that there's. There's there's already some weaknesses I can see with Toa's strategy gotcha. because he primarily throws fastballs. Right, and because people are going to be studying him because of this whole preseason thing, mm-hmm. that can be a fun way where then he also needs to develop. Because I feel like that's where he's going to really start having fun. It's not just from winning money, because right. that'll be great. That'll be great. Yeah. But when it's also the, 
Oh, okay. Oh, he starts throwing change-ups. Yeah, he starts throwing change-ups. Like, it gets to the he point where it's the, even if you, even if you did the 499, you know, like, like, one-ounce games, and, you know, you never lost one until Kojima, sure. suddenly it's like, oh, now I actually have to get better, right? Mm -hmm. Because I end up running up against people that, you know, are like Kojima, and they have been studying me in the same way that I would be picking them apart, you know? Yep. And, and, you know, all this might not happen at all, and this might just be a story about how um, uh, Toa and Kojima become fast friends throughout all yep. this, and it becomes an emotional journey about oh, yeah. learning what was Toa's backstory and sure. what brought him to this place, and then I'm learning about what he, what he really wants, you know, out mm -hmm. of life. And we can see that, too. I think the OP yep. kind of hints at that kind of emotion potentially coming yeah. into play. And they do very we'll much see. feel like the the odd couple, you know, <laughs> right? Where it's like they're about as opposite as you can get. You right, know? right. Both in physique and hair color and demeanor and, demeanor, you know, and everything. everything yeah. And, you know, Kojima has now learned from Toa, mm -hmm. right? So where when's the, when's the reverse happen? Yeah, probably at the very end, if at all. <laughs> sure. Yeah. But uh, yeah, y'all, thank you so much for watching this episode's reaction and discussion. If you want to see the next episode's reaction and discussion right now, though, go check out the link in the description below for our Patreon. You can get an early access there. You can watch full length timer reactions there. And all this comes with Discord access. You can chat with us in the community there about this show, about anime in general. And also be sure to check out our Twitch channel. We stream every weekday. The info's in the description. Yeah, so if any of that interests you, we'll see you there. But until then, we're Semblance of Sanity. I'm Caleb. I'm Jacob. And we'll see you all next time. time.